legends and super legends. Welcome to Velo Harmony. Today we're going to be talking about recovery with compression. Why is that significant? Those of you who have been following the recent rides when we did the RBC Grand Fundo, we found out that Paul showed up tired because he, did, he was not well, first of all, and his legs were just not fresh. So that's all part of the process. So let's say we use the, the prior three weeks to the event, we built up our mileage and we rode longer and longer in more challenging terrain. In order to be able to do that, we had to recover. So you can recover within the, the weekly cycle, but you can also recover over the period of the training that you were doing. So before I started that phase, I took a rest week and then I started training. And what had happened was he did not do that. So as a result, he came there in combination with getting sick the last weekend before the event. And he had not fully recovered from that. That was all a combination. So I want to talk about recovery in terms of as you're building up, you know, spring is here. The weather's clearing. You're going to get excited and pumped up. And that's what happened. Paul was excited about his improvement. And but he missed a part of the training that calls for recovery because training is not just working out it's work and rest. Then your body absorbs the training and then you, you're, you're improved. So when you're training a lot, you need to also plan your recovery. You got to plan. You cannot miss that part. I use uh, recovery garments that have compression in them. I've always used them. And then MD, our sponsor sent recovery socks. I tested that. I wore that the week before the event, especially that weekend. I was in it all week. I'm wearing it right now is what it looks like. It's another one here. OK, so they've got that logo on the back. I don't know if you'll be able to see it if I just turn it around it's in red. Right back here. And I'll show you on this one. OK, MD makes a lot of medical products. Uh, they're not just into sports stuff. The reason I decided to go with them is they're not just making compression socks. They're making what is called graduated compression socks. And in addition to this graduation being in there, it has order fighting uh, uh, qualities. It has uh, wicking properties. So I was able to wear this stuff a whole day. I actually slept in it. I washed it. It still holds its form, which is important. Okay. That's important. Now, what's the significance of graduated compression? Not all compression garments are created equal. In other words, just like when you're kneading something, let's say you're squeezing something out of a tube. What do you do? You continue to apply pressure as you go up to keep moving things. That's what the significance is. You can't just go and buy just any compression garment. You want a compression garment that has graduated compression, meaning it continues to apply pressure as it approaches the heart. Why is that significant? Well, the human body, normally when you work out, your muscles create toxins like creatine kinase, lactic acid, whatever. These are all byproducts. If you don't get them out of there, either by a good recovery spin, a massage, soaking in the tub with Epsom salt and a lot of things you can do which require more time and effort. If you don't do any of that, your muscles are tighter the next day. So you really cannot push that hard. Those of you who work out with weights, you, you experience the same thing. You can't work the same. You, you could if you, if you wanted to, but what would happen is your quality would go down because the muscles are still fatigued if they have not recovered. So to, to enhance your training to get you to the next level quickly, you work on your recovery after you've worked out. So after a hard workout, first of all, you make sure you take internal recovery drinks and you put on recovery garments like these socks, for example. With graduated compression, what happens is it's like you're squeezing a tube of toothpaste. The compression is applied throughout the garment. So it's going to push the blood back to the heart faster than if you were not wearing compression garments. Why is that significant? Well, the human body takes oxygenated blood from the heart and it moves it to your muscles with nutrients and oxygen, which is what you need when you work out. You need oxygen in there. Well, the byproducts have to get back in the return flow of the blood to the heart to pick up more oxygen. The quicker they can get back there, the quicker it will come back with fresh blood for you to be able to continue to work out. So after your workout, if you wear the proper compression garments, 
The next day, you will have fresher legs and you'll be able to work out even harder. And of course, you're going to improve quicker because you have better recovery. That's the significance of it. And also, if you have an event coming after you've done your block of training, by putting these on, you will speed the recovery of your legs to the point where the day of the event, you have fresh legs and you're ready to go. It keeps your consistency and it keeps your improvement in that direction. That's that's the significance. So... What, uh, what we've decided to do, MD sent a batch of compression garments, the compression socks that I just showed you. Let me read some of the qualities of them, and I will put some here in post-production for those of you who retain things visually. Um, they call them the Winter Bamboo Travel Compression Socks, and, it, and it's unisex. So it, it's like a mild, they call it mild B50 milligram, millimeters HG graduated support socks. They, they refer to them as stockings, but because they're so long, that's why. So for relieving your tired leg and feet, that's why I mentioned graduate. Whenever you're looking for compression stuff, you want to make sure the compression is graduated. You don't want the compression just in one spot. That's what it means. Throughout the garment, you've got that effect. I was able to use the thing. I washed it. It held its form. Good quality. That's the reason I'm doing this video. The, the garments here are sold in a pack of three. And what we're going to do for all the subscribers on this channel, we're going to do a giveaway of, the, of this product. This is size 10 to 13 US and UK. Size 10 to 13. Three pairs in here. We're gonna we're gonna do it for the for this spring. So the the giveaway will run until June 21st. June 21st is the first day of summer this year. So we're gonna hold a little giveaway contest for subscribers only. If you're not subscribed, you're, you're not eligible. And we we want to at least have people that ride a minimum of 100 kilometers on the road. If you're not riding, you don't need compression garments. I mean, if you're not working out, so. That's kind of the qualification to, for the entry. For you to be eligible, you need to be a subscriber and you need to ride at least 100 kilometers for one week. And if you're on the Strava Club for Velo Harmony, you don't need to do anything. We'll verify your stats there. Make sure in your entry, we're going to put all the details in the description. Make sure in your entry that you post, you, you state what your Strava name is so we can link you up and be able to do that. If you're not on the Velo Harmony Club, you can always send us your Strava uh, uh, stats if you wish, or you can follow us on Strava and we'll be able to get that. At any point from this release of this video until June 21st, you just need to cover 100 kilometers in one week. The reason we're doing that is those of you diehards that do a lot of miles, yeah, you're probably wondering why 100 kilometers. I want to include everybody. I want to include the people who spend more time on their trainers. I want them to get outside. Trainer miles don't count. You need to do it outside. Whether you ride around in a circle in the neighborhood, I don't care. You need to get out of the house and do it. It's spring. Find a way to do it. You've got till June 21st to do it. When you go to the entry, it will link you to the website entry page. Put an address, your name that you want this to be sent to if you're, if you're the winner. Put the information on there. So um, I'm going to go ahead and wrap that up by just saying that if you're going to be working out consistently, it helps to have some recovery aids. And this is a great recovery aid to include in your kit. Uh, I will put the link to the Amazon shop for those of you who are not fortunate enough to win that batch. It's a good price point. And that we'll be bringing additional products that make other socks and stuff that they've sent that I will do other videos on. But I wanted to introduce this to you guys because it is important that you get the right type of compression garment. Don't just go out and just buy a compression garment. Make sure it is graduated compression. That's one of the other reasons why I decided to go with MD as a sponsor. They understand compression because graduated compression is the way to go. It is not going to put your, your, your legs or your feet to sleep because it is done right, okay? So with that being the case, keep getting those Ks in and go ahead and sign up for the, for the giveaway.